Paul Langer. I'm the president of Footbone Orthotic Laboratory. And today we're going to show digitizing a patient's foot with the plantar digitizer, which is made by virtual 3D technologies. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to enter, enter a new patient's name. We do that with our touch screen. We just type in the patient's name on the system, directly on the keypad. And now we're ready to digitize this patient. We can capture the foot in neutral position, weight bearing or off weight bearing. I prefer to capture neutral positioning and, and load the fourth and fifth, load the lateral column by putting direct pressure on the fourth and fifth metatarsal heads. So first, you can see I have enough room here to, to move, it, move this patient's foot around anywhere I want. I can position this foot with any of the techniques that we normally use. We can load the fourth and fifth metatarsal head. We can do a suspension technique. We can just do a standard um, unloaded uh, uh, digi digital map of the foot. But I prefer to get an off weight bearing, subtail in neutral position, and we lock the lateral column. That flesh is how long it takes to do the actual digital mapping of the foot. It's stroboscopic, and in so we stop motion with this system. This is not a scanning system. This captures the foot instantaneously in one image. We move on to the other foot. Again, the same thing. We find neutral subtalar position. Relax now. Find neutral subtalar position. We load the lateral column. And I can, I can leave two hands on the foot, and I can use a foot switch to activate if I want. Now I can, I can see that my target is on the foot, so we know that we've got a good image. I can accept that, and then I can start to enter a prescription for this patient. We bring up our patients. This is the patient I just digitized. I select their digital map from today. I got to edit that. We can select the, de the device type. If we're going to make a, a daily wear orthotic, semi rigid. I'm going to put my posting instructions on here. So I'm going to put four degrees in the rear foot. We can select forefoot posting, rear foot posting. Intrinsic, extrinsic, whatever the doctor would normally select for a, a plaster cast, we can do with the system. We have all the typical shell modifications. If the doctor wants a deep heel seat on the left and right, if we want to put a medial flange, all of these things are available. Select from any range of top covers. If we want to put a, an eighth inch top cover, let's say, for the toes. If we want to put extensions, I can do that all the various paddings and modifications. And then, of course, I can send special instructions to the laboratory if I just want to send a note to the lab. save that and we'd send that off to the lab via secure FTP. It comes right to Footbone Orthotic Lab. It goes into our manufacturing system. We can make any type of orthotic at all. If the doctor's normally getting a plastic cast or a biofilm cast, we can do that with the plant digitizer.